Hello my crafty friends. Welcome back to my studio of Perpetual Mojo. For today's painting episode, I went online, I went through all of my pins on Pinterest in the category of fabulous stuff I want to try. And I found this wonderful recipe for water painting on glue that's been salted. Yes, you heard me. The pin was from Tammy of Housing a Forest, and I knew I had to try it. So let's go see how it's done. Here I am again with one of those very cheap plastic frames. And this is gonna be my background. This is what I'm working with today. This is just an old mat that was kind of stained and ruined already. So I'm gonna paint it up in a really cool way today. This is a really cool time saver. It's two pieces of painter's tape on both sides of one piece of wax paper. So all you need to do is peel off one side and then the other. And if you don't use them all, you can store them on a piece of wax paper. I'm gonna use black paint to paint this frame and I'm using a Tiffany and Heidi trick using a cosmetic sponge to paint it on. I'm all ready to go now. I've got my Aline's Quick Dry Tacky Glue and I've put a piece of tape on the nozzle and wrapped it around like Heidi shows us how to do to make a narrow opening for the glue. That way I can control the flow of it. I've got some regular table salt watercolors and water and this is how it goes. I've got my glue line here and I'm going to completely cover it with salt. I'm going to tap off the extra salt. Then I'm going to reclaim later on and now I've got I'm going to pick up a little bit of a lime green here, and I'm just barely going to touch the salt. You want it nice and wet, but not so wet that it makes your canvas wet. Ooh, that's so pretty. I love it. I love the way that the salt got kind of soft and it almost looks like it's been felted, the frame. Very cool. Thank you so much, Tammy of Housing the Forest. If you're inspired to try something like that, I hope you'll share it with us. Email me, Candace at CoolToCraft.com at any time with any story and high resolution photos and I will get them posted on our creative community blog. I'm Candace, and I think it's cool to craft. 